But I've had just about every piece of filth written about me. I just think maybe if I just told the truth for once, told the whole story, maybe I'll be better judged. The story of Tim Bell is really the story of influence over the last 50 years. The founder of Bell Pottinger, Tim Bell. The great Tim Bell, Lord Bell, who was Mrs. Thatcher's favorite ad man, masterminded her three election victories. I didn't really know what I was good at, but I was a good salesman. Now, you moved advertising into a workable weapon. This was the beginning of a very new and burgeoning industry. They keep on saying he worked for Pinochet. I did not. I never met Pinochet. But well, you, did, you did meet him? I did meet him. I met him in, ten years earlier in, um, in uh, Santiago. Are oh, you allowed to know all your clients? Um, you can know all those except, unfortunately, the government. A $500 million contract in Iraq. As a journalist, you start thinking, what's happening here? Something's not OK. What went wrong? The British public relations company, Bell Pottinger, stands accused of fomenting racial tensions in post-apartheid South Africa. You know, this is a perfect environment to influence narratives and play on fear. I am going up against one of the biggest PR firms in the world. And we begin to excavate the rot, the tooth. Foreign leaders and dictators, big corporations, Russian oligarchs. He's the guy behind the scenes can fix it. Is this how the world works? It's one of the ways the world works. Go anywhere, do anything, was very much the bumper sticker.